Hi, you guys. It's Joe. <clears throat> I'm always doing that, clearing my throat before each video. Sorry. Um, I'm extremely, extremely bored right now. Bored out of my mind. And I have time to make a video. So I'm gonna <laughs> have a lot of time to make like 50 videos. So I'm just gonna make one right now. And I hope you guys like it. This is gonna be an updated version of my whole perfume collection. All my scents. Half of these are just bottles and no perfumes left in them because they ran out but I'm still gonna mention them in the video because I did like them and they were part of my collection and I keep the bottles so I'm just gonna show you guys so let me start off with Aeris by Paris Hilton this one is completely gone yep but I can still smell it from the nozzle, and, um, it's very bubblegummy, pop, um, <clears throat> it's a cute bottle. I think it's one of my favorite Paris Hilton, um, perfumes, and um, it's just really, it's cute. It's cute. It actually came out a long time ago. It smells good, though. Very sweet bubblegum scent. That's Paris Hilton Aris. The next one is How Would You Go Love Is Love. And it's cute bottle. This one's also out. I have nothing left. A little came out, but really nothing left. Just very floral scent. And um, that's her. Very cute. Um, the perfumes that I'm mentioning and they're out, I probably will get another bottle of them because I really like them, but I have no money, so I'm not going to buy any, if anything, I'll buy a new one than the one I already had. <clears throat> Next one is Fantasy, and this one's also completely out. This was the 50 ml. This actually lasted me a couple of years, so I'm, I'm, I'm happy. This is Fantasy by Britney Spears. It's very sweet, candy-like. I normally only wore this in the fall and the winter. I don't wear this in the summer or the spring. Next one is Daisy by Marc Jacobs. Again, completely out. <laughs> very floral, sweet floral. Yeah, a sweet, sweet floral. Um... That was just Daisy's coming out. It's a cute bottle. Um, yeah. Daisy by Mark Jacobs. Had that one. I like that one, too. Next one is... Ed Hardy. And it smells like strawberries and champagne. A sweet, sweet strawberry fruity smell. And again, this is completely out. I really like this one. I really like this one. All I did was spray this one. I mean, I loved it. And this, again, lasted me for a long time. It's a 15-mil bottle. It lasted me for, like, a year. So, that's good. That's good. The money, you know, the money's worth it. It lasts for, lasts for a long time. Next one is Mysterio Sherry, and I do have a lot left of this because I just got it, and... I usually only wear this on special occasions, like, or, like, a holiday Easter... Or I'll wear this to, like, an anniversary party or so, you know, stuff like that. You know, that's the only time I wear Mysterio Chevy. Because it's very, mm, very oldy, but a sweet oldy. It's not like White Diamonds, like, oldy grandma smell. It's like a sweet oldy smell. Like, it's something I would wear if I was 70. You know what I mean? Like, it's, it's a sweet old, a sweet old smell. Misty or Sherry. <clears throat> also, um, I'm going to be whatever perfume you see and you like. Tell me you want to review and I'll review it for you. Because I know perfumes really well. And um, I can I can really tell you about the scent in, in, in a way that no one else could really tell you. Because I'm, I'm a perfume expert. I love perfumes. I love smelling things. It's, it's just me. It's my nature. I've been trying to get a job at Macy's. Like, when I go there with my friends, 
I'm like showing my friends the fragrances and it looks like I work at Macy's <laughs> and, and showing them what what smells good and what's what and what's, you know. So I'll be good working at a perfume counter at Macy's because I'm pretty sure I got the job down pat. Next one is Live by Jennifer Lopez. I have still a little left of this. Um, I usually wear this when I'm out to the club or partying. Very upbeat, fruity smell. Very exciting and sensual and sexy. It's very cute. Put that one over there. Next one I have is Rebel Flower uh, by Rihanna. Rihanna. It's actually Rebel Flory, Flor, or something like that in Fr French, but it's Rebel Flower in French, and it's by Rihanna, her first fragrance. Um, it's really cute. It's actually one of my favorite fragrances. I just sprayed it on here just like 10 minutes ago, and I still smell it. It smells really good. I'm going to do a review on this very soon because I've been wanting to do a review on this one. It's very a sweet sandalwood forest smell, but it's like a sweet, it's not like, you know, sandalwood, like fresh wood or something. It's it's more like a sweet toned down sandalwood. Um, that's what it smells like. And um, a little bit of vanilla amber and stuff. It's good. I'm going to do a review on this. It's a good one. This is the 100 mil. It's nice. Next one is Purr by Katy Perry. I, already, I just did a review on this one. Gorgeous scent. I told you it's one of my favorites. Peach, apple, vanilla. Um, a lot of nice things in this one. Just spread on the wrist. It smells really nice. Mm. Yeah, this is definitely like number one. Or number two. Well, Midnight Fantasy and this are in like a tie right now. I don't I can't choose which one I like more. <clears throat> Next one is I Fancy You by Jessica Simpson, and this just came out, I think, a couple of weeks ago. And, um, mm, it smells very fresh, like clean linen, but then it has, like, a zesty citrus to it, too. Kind of reminds me of, like, floating on, like, a cloud at night. Like, I, I spray this on my pillows at night. I just smell it, and it's just so refreshing and, like, um... So comfortable and so relaxing. It's such a relaxing smell. I you know, really like it. This is the new one called I Fancy You. It's a cute bottle. I'm going to do a review on this one too. I just got this one. Yep. Next one is Circus Fantasy. And I really want to get a new bottle of this because I loved it. But there's nothing left. So, But I, I remember the smell like it was yesterday. Mm, fresh, sweet apricot. Very sweet fruit. Oh god, I love it. I still love it. I really want to get a new bottle of this. This is Decker's Fancy Deep River Needs to be as. Next one is Miami Glow by JLo. And I just did a review on this too recently. And it's very summery, tropical beachy, suntan lotion smell that you should only wear during the summer. That's it. It's gorgeous. Next one is Britney Spears Curious, and I just finished this a couple days ago. It was the last squirt, so I put it away. I put everything in their boxes. Let me show you. I put everything, when I'm done with a perfume, I put it back in its box, like this, curious. I put that back in its box, and I put it in this bag, where all the perfume boxes are, and I put it up in the closet, and I keep it right there. So, I have the bottle forever, because it's a, it's a memory that, that I've had in my life. The fragrance, the scent. Um, I always want to keep those memories. So when I have a perfume bottle, I keep it, and I keep it, they're gorgeous, like why not keep the perfume bottle, they're, they're so sexy, they're so, you know what I mean, like, they're really cute, so I keep it, and I keep the box, I keep it all when it runs out, so, great, so the next, so what I was talking about was Curious for Britney Spears, it was one of my favorite ones in the beginning when I started collecting perfumes, very sweet floral, but 
you know, I've gotten a lot more since this. You know, this was like my first fragrance I ever gotten, and it was a present for my grandma for Christmas. So I do keep this near the end of my heart. It smells really good, and I still really like it. So I may buy another one. Although I'm, if I buy another one, it's going to be 50 mils, not 100, because the pump, I can't stand it. I can't stand it. I really can't. I hate it. No perfume comes out, and when it does come out, like, there's, oh, there's still a couple of squirt slots. Mmm. It's nice. Mmm. It smells like Macy's. Um, when they do come out, I mean, it's, it's not like a big blast of a squirt. It's just a little mist, and you really don't get much of the fragrance. So try getting the, the, um, the regular nozzle than a pump like this, because it's, it's not cool. I don't like it. <clears throat> um... Next one is Viva La Juicy, and actually this is all out too, but there's still a couple drops left, so. Mm. Sweet caramel. I smell just a lot of caramel in this, sweet caramel smell. It's good Viva La Juicy, it's good, 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 good. Then we have this cute bottle, cute everything. I had, I've been through a few of these. They're really good. It's a really good fragrance. Next one and the last one is Midnight Fantasy by Britney Spears and I got the hearts, the charm hearts from the Curious Bottle because I'm done with that and so I just took it off and put it on this bottle because I love the bottle and I love the charm so I did that. And this is by far my favorite, favorite, favorite fragrance. It smells very sweet and fruity and blueberry, plum, freesia, vanilla. brings me back to the winter. I only wear this in the winter, really. Oh, it's really nice. It's really, really nice. Yes, I've been through, like, every size of this bottle. 50, 30, 100, all of it. This is the 50. And that's that. Those are all my perfumes. Let me show you um, a side view of all of them. So you, you see the whole collection. This is my perfume collection. Updated perfume collection. And you guys... We guys had a fun time looking at all the perfumes and all my memories I've gotten from each perfume and just the smells and the looks and everything. And there we have it. And that's a picture of my sister, brother, and me. <laughs> yeah. Okay. When we were younger. Okay, so that's that. And you guys have a great night. Tell me what you want to, what I, what I should reveal out of the perfumes, and I will do that. Good night, guys.